Hello guys, today we'll be looking at one of the important quant problems which you can see most frequent in most of the sections of GRE exam. So this is basically a quantitative comparison problem where two quantities are given and you have to find out which of the quantity is larger or smaller. So let's look at the problem. So here the quantity A is given as a multiplication of two numbers. Similarly, the quantity B is given with a multiplication of two different numbers. And they are asking to find out which quantity is greater, either A, B and if they are equal or the relationship cannot be determined from the given information. Obviously, it cannot be your option D because the information is sufficient for us to find out which number is greater. So the intuitive thinking comes in the mind that we can directly use a calculator present in a GRE test section. But if you think this is a approach one, this is obviously it is incorrect because the GRE calculator cannot hold more than a particular set of digits. So you cannot create a multiplication with these set of numbers. So we'll be doing this question without using any calculator by using a different trick. So in this question, quantity A is given as a multiplication of two numbers. Similarly, quantity B is given. What we will do is we will just divide both the quantities with a particular number which is present in quantity A. So in this question, we will divide both the quantities with this number 35043. You can choose obviously, obviously choose this number as well. But I'll sh tell you how you can approach this problem. So if we divide both these quantities with this number, what you will get is 25430 from quantity A and A into B by the same number in quantity B because you have divided the same quantity with 35043. Now the second step to solve this problem is divide both the quantities, the uh, remaining numbers with 2503 which is present in the second number. So we have chosen one number from set A and another number from set B and we have divided both these quantities with these numbers. So now we have gotten to a fraction. So from multiplication we have reached to a set of fraction A by B and A dash by B dash. Now this can be easily solved by a GRE calculator which is present in the screen. So once we use that calculator we can find out that quantity A is 1.0154 and quantity B is 1.0110. Obviously 4 is greater than 1.0. So hence quantity A is greater than quantity B. Hence we have reached to the answer. So this is the way which we can solve this problem whenever we are faced to find out the multiplication of two numbers which cannot be solved by the GRE calculator. Let's solve another question in the next slide. 